how did you hear about the Winnipeg situation? Um, and how has your time been here uh, at the gallery itself and in Winnipeg? Well, the space is super nice. I'm really happy with the space, getting to have that much space where I can do a graffiti piece and I can do a little bit mural work and I can hang some fine art and I can play with some other stuff. So the, 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 the space, I'm really happy with such a large space. It's really fun to work within that space. You know, you have the scaffold. The, I, don't, I don't know if you call it scaffolding, but the, the walkway, the catwalk up top looking down on things and you can sit there on the couches and look at things it's like I, I'm um, it's a fun space to be in so uh, Pat and Erica have been treating me real well they have uh, fed me very nicely and have given me uh, very uh, proper um, accommodations very I feel um, well taken care of so I've had friends, my friend Ernie's come up here, my friend Say's come up here, done work, my friend Chino's come up here and done work. So, um, all of them have had uh, very good reviews of, the, of what goes on here, so um, I will uh, concur with their uh, reviews. So. Cool. And you just, uh, we'll ask question, uh, just, so just maybe you're doing murals for the Winnipeg show, you're doing some graffiti, you're doing some fine art stuff. Is, yes. Uh, Want to just maybe elaborate a tinge on that? or? Well, it's a mixed bag. Uh, the show's called Puzzle Pieces. And um, it's kind of all pieces that create a whole. Um, on the whole, these are the pieces, you know, all, all the different things I do. Some is straight traditional graffiti, some is a little bit more mural oriented, more fine art then there's actual fine art pieces on wood panel there's some drawings it's a it's a mixed bag of stuff you know ranging from vandalism to the mona lisa so um it's i'm trying to show a, a variety here i'm trying to show a uh, eclectic mixture and i'm trying to show us uh multiple skill levels so that's what I'm hoping to do, and um, with the space being that big, I'm, it's nice to get to play with spray paint again. I don't get to play with it that often these days, so it's uh, it's been it's been a uh, absolute um, good time. I'm going to throw one more question at you because I do have a little bit of time left. Um, any advice for people that uh, want to quit quit while you're ahead? No, go ahead. Any advice for uh, upcoming artists? Like young oh, people? upcoming artists. Um, upcoming artists. Okay, this is what you got to know. It's a hell of a bumpy road. And you're going to be uh, handed more rejection than acceptance. Um, you're going to be rejected from projects that you want. You're going to be rejected from galleries you want. You're going to be rejected from shows and probably even friends and other people are going to be look at you like what the hell are you doing what is this so y y you're going to have to my advice to upcoming artists is perseverance and hard work always work always practice your craft always work to improve what you're doing N never settle and just to understand that you're probably going to get a lot of a lot more no's than yeses before you you get a lot of yeses. So um, hold on, it's a bumpy ride for a very long time. 